Uh, in the name of Lord Jesus Christ, I speak. We are very thankful to God uh, that our brothers and sisters are able to make time uh, to join in this uh, spiritual convocation. Uh, we know that uh, the spiritual convocation uh, is an occasion on which uh, we can draw closer to God. Uh, not only uh, we must uh, uh, listen to the word of God uh, tentatively with our hearts of uh, uh, reverence. Uh, we also need to make use of uh, time, you know, to offer more prayers to God during this uh, spiritual convocation. Uh, because we need to prepare our mind and our heart uh, so that we can receive uh, the word of God more easily. Uh, so even uh, when we uh, are having a fellowship with one another, uh, we should speak words of encouragement to stir up our faith and love. Uh, so that uh, we are more ready to receive uh, the word of God. Uh, after we have like you know returned home after the first day, uh, we also need to spend more time in prayer. Uh, we need to read the word and to think about what you have heard today. Uh, in this way, we can prepare ourselves in totality to worship God. Uh, thank God uh, today I'm going to talk about the parable of the sower. Uh, when we, whenever we talk about taking root, uh, there are always uh, two aspects uh, to it. Uh, one is the word of God must take root in our heart. Uh, so when we have the word of God deeply rooted in us, then we shall not be easily shaken by the things of the world. Uh, because with the word of God in our heart and our focus can be solely on God. Uh, we can turn to the book of Colossians. Uh, we turn to the book of Colossians. Uh, we read uh, chapter 3. Uh, verse 16. Uh, chapter 3, verse 16. Let the word of, of Christ dwell in you richly in all wisdom, teaching and admonishing one another in psalms and hymns and spiritual songs, uh, singing with grace in your hearts to the Lord. 哥罗西书三章十六节，奉主耶稣圣名读圣经。当用各样的智慧，把基督的道理丰丰富富的存在心里。Here, uh, you know, uh, Paul is teaching us that we must rely on all wisdom to ensure that the word of God uh, dwells within us uh, richly. Uh, so quite clearly that to keep the word of God in the heart or to root the word of God requires a lot of efforts on our parts. Uh, so we must do it with all diligence. Uh, because we must allow the word of God to become the guiding principles of our life. Uh, so that whatever we do, we will always follow you know, the word of God. Uh, so when we talk about taking root, uh, this is the first type of uh, rooting, that is, the word of God must deeply root us. 
如果我哋講到扎根嘅話，首先我哋要讓神嘅話嚟嚟去深深喺我哋心裏邊去扎根。Uh, the second aspect is about we ourselves must take root in God。咁第二個方面就係話，我哋自己一定要喺神嘅面前、神嘅裏面嚟到扎根。Uh, after we have been baptized into Christ。當我哋受洗嗰日基督之後。Uh, we are told that we are in Christ Jesus. Our existence is in Christ. 就係話我哋被誒、呃、告訴，我哋就喺基督裏邊啦。啊、uh, ，so we are we are separated clearly from the world。咁我哋好清楚與呢個世界嚟個嚟到分別出嚟啦。啊、uh, ，so even though we are in this world， but we are not。Uh, of the world. 雖然我哋住喺呢個世界上邊，但係我哋係唔屬於呢個世界。Uh, since we are still in the world, then obviously we are exposed to all types of corruptions and influences from the world. 既然我哋喺世界上邊嚟到，當然會有會面對世上好多唔同嘅腐敗敗壞嘅事情。Uh, we face with a lot of trials and tribulations in life. 我哋喺人生裏邊面對好多困難、挑戰、患難。Uh, so if we can take、uh, root in Christ Jesus， 如果我哋能夠將誒扎根扎扎喺基督耶穌嘅身上 ，then we shall not easily、uh, be strayed away。我哋就唔能夠好容易咁嚟被搖動啦。Uh, we are just likened、uh, to a tree、uh, planted by the waters。就好似一棵樹誒，種喺呢個水旁一樣。啊 ，you know it's like its roots has reached you know the the water。我哋知道佢嘅根已經係種入咗誒，探入咗水嘅入邊啦。啊 ，meaning that you know the person has a close connection to God。意思就係話呢個人同神有緊密嘅關係啊。According to the scriptures, then he will not fear you know、uh, Uh, the heat when it comes。咁根據聖經所講俾我哋聽，佢係唔惧怕炎熱嘅來臨噶。You find that you know its leaves should always remain green and healthy。我哋睇到佢嘅樹葉係非常之青綠，而且係好健康噶。The Bible tells us that you know such a person will not be anxious in times of troubles。咁聖經亦都話俾我哋聽，呢種嘅人喺誒患難嘅時候，佢哋係唔惧怕噶。So basically, there are two types of Uh, taking roots as far as the scriptures is concerned。就根據聖經所記載嘅，係所以扎根係有呢兩方面。Uh, so for today,、uh, I'm going to talk about the parable of the sower。咁今日我哋與大家分享呢個撒種嘅比喻。Uh, you find that this parable is quite unique。我哋知道呢個誒比喻係非常之獨特嘅。Jesus, uh, uh, you know, uh, based uh, his uh, teaching. Not, not only he teaches the disciples。所以主耶穌用呢個比喻，唔單止係教到佢嘅門徒而已。It actually tells the disciples the purpose of parables。咁亦都話俾佢嘅門徒聽，點解用比喻嗰個目的。He he is using this parable to tell the disciples why he you know uh, uh, always are taught in parables。咁佢藉著呢個比喻嚟到去話俾門徒聽，點解佢？主耶穌時常用比喻嚟教導人。Uh, and we also see that you know Jesus and then、uh, goes on to talk about uh, the uh, meaning uh, of this parable。咁主耶穌繼續講下呢個比喻嘅意思係乜嘢 ？So for today, yeah, we are going to look at first look at the purpose of parables。咁今日我哋睇下呢個比喻嘅目的。Uh, because I guess you know to understand what Jesus is saying here is essential for us to understand。Also, other parables。咁如果我哋明白咗主耶穌所講嘅比喻嘅目的，咁我哋亦都明白其他主耶穌所講嘅比喻啦。And this parable is also recorded in the book of Mark。咁呢個比喻亦都記載喺馬可福音裏邊嘅。And it is also recorded in the book of Luke。亦都喺路加福音嗰度所記載嘅。We first turn to the account in Matthew, Matthew chapter thirteen。我哋首先嚟要翻開馬太福音所記載嘅馬太福音十三章。Uh, we will cross reference to other gospels。我哋要對照其他嘅誒福音書。Uh, now we first look at the verse ten。我哋首先嚟十三章第十節。Uh, chapter thirteen verse ten。馬太福音十三章第十節。And the disciples came and said to him, Why do you speak to them in parables? 第十節，門徒眾前來問耶穌說：對眾人講話，為什麼用比喻咧 ？Because at the time, you know, there were many people gathered together。因為當時係好多人聚集一起。So that Jesus actually got into a boat。
so the whole multitude stood on the shore. So the whole multitude stood on the shore. And 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 Uh, when you look at the Gospel of Luke, chapter eight, verse twenty-two, 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 Or those who are not close to Jesus, or those who are not close to Jesus, it's like they were not able to understand the parables that Jesus has expounded. They just couldn't understand what Jesus was saying. Now, I want you to look at the reason given in verse eleven. Now, I want you to look at the reason given in verse eleven. Now, I want you to look at the reason given in verse eleven. Now, I want you to look at the reason given in verse eleven. Now, I want you to look at the reason given in verse eleven. Now, I want you to look at the reason given in verse eleven. Now, I want you to look at the reason given in verse eleven. Now, I want you to look at the reason given in verse eleven. But to them, it has not been given. 第十一节，耶稣回答说：因为天国的奥秘，只叫你们知道，不叫他们知道。A parable is like a life story. 咁呢个比喻就系好似人生嘅故事咁样。You know, the listeners should be able to associate, you know, with the contents of the parable that Jesus has spoken. 咁听嘅人应该就联系到主耶稣所讲嘅比喻同佢哋人生嘅生活上嘅。Uh, when you look at the reply from Jesus Christ, we will see how Jesus' reply.、Uh, Jesus says it has been given to you to know the mystery of the kingdom of heaven. Jesus said, "Because the kingdom of heaven is given to you to know." Quite clearly, the parables of Jesus are about matters concerning the kingdom of of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very clearly, Jesus' parable is about matters concerning the kingdom of God. Very Anyone else apart from for the disciple? 咁呢个隐藏个奥秘唔系俾其他人嘅，系俾只系呢个门徒噶。啊 ，Now I want you to turn to Mark. 我哋打开马可福音。啊 ，Please turn to the Gospel of Mark. 请打开马可福音。啊 ，We read、um, chapter four. 我哋读下第四章。啊 ，Mark chapter four. 马可福音嘅第四章。We read verse eleven。我哋读第十一节。Mark four verse eleven。马可福音十一章十一节。And he said to them, "To you it has been given to know the mystery of the kingdom of God, but to those who are outside, all things come in parables." 马可福音四章十一节，耶稣对他们说：神国的奥秘只叫你们知道，若是对外人。It's like here, you know, Jesus make a distinction between his own disciple and those who are outside, not within his circles. 咁主耶稣有一个诶讲到好清楚嘅分别，就系话佢嘅门徒同其他嘅外人嗰种嘅分别。So for the disciples, those who belongs to Jesus, they will be given the mystery of the kingdom of God to understand the word. 就系话耶稣嘅门徒就系属于耶稣嘅。佢哋就得到明白呢個神國嘅嗰種嘅奧秘。啊 ，but for those who are outside, all things come in parables。但對於外人嚟講嘅，凡事都係用比喻㗎。Meaning that they would not be able to understand。意思就話佢哋唔會明白㗎。How do we know that they they are not able to understand？ 我哋點樣知道佢哋唔會明白咧 ？Because if you read Mark chapter four verse twelve, this is a citation from Isaiah。咁我哋如果讀馬可福音四章十二節，就係好似誒誒以賽亞書嗰度所記載。啊 ，meaning that they would not be able to see and to hear, you know, and to know the word of God。意思就係話佢哋看係看得見，但係唔曉得；聽係聽得見，係唔明白㗎。啊 ，that's why you know some people may said。所以就係有啲人咁樣講。啊 ，this parable of the sower actually is like a 
uh, a parable designed for like evangelism. 咁有啲人就話呢個撒種嘅比喻就好似我哋宣道嘅時候所講嘅。啊 ，in fact this is quite true as well。其實呢個係真實噶。啊 ，because when you look at、uh, you know、uh, some of our truth seekers， 如果你睇下我哋一部分嘅誒慕道者，啊 ，many of our truth seekers you know、uh, respond yeah to the word of God、uh, very differently from one another。因為唔同嘅慕道者對我哋嘅道理所作出嚟嘅反應都係唔同嘅。啊 ，some they accept because they that they have been chosen by God。有啲係佢領受神嘅話語，因為佢係被神所揀選嘅。啊 ，some refuse to accept。有啲係拒絕嚟到領受。啊 ，because they are not willing to understand or to listen。有啲因為佢哋唔願意嚟到去明白，唔願意去聆聽。啊 ，we can turn to the Gospel of Luke。係啊，路加福音。Uh, we turn to the Gospel of Luke chapter eight. 路加福音嘅第八章。Uh, we read、uh, verse ten. Yeah. 我哋读第十节。Uh, Gospel of Luke chapter eight,、uh, verse ten. 路加福音八章第十节。And he said to you, it has been given to know the mystery of the kingdom of God, but here it says, but to the rest, it is given in parables. 第十节，他说：神国的奥秘，只叫你们知道。至于别人，就用比喻，叫他们看也看不见，听也听不明。啊、uh, ，so it's like you know from what we have read so far, for those who are outside or for those who do not belong to the circle of Christ, the parables are intended not to be understood by them. 咁，正如頭先我哋所讀嘅經文咁樣樣。神國嘅奧秘，嗰啲唔屬於耶穌、冇喺耶穌嘅圈子裏邊嗰啲人，外邊嘅人咧，佢哋係唔明白嘅。Uh, now I want you to turn back to Matthew。我哋翻翻嚟馬太福音。Uh, because in as far as the purpose of parables uh, uh, is concerned, Jesus、uh, has given a detailed、uh, explanation to that。咁因為呢個天國誒，講呢個比喻嘅目的，咁主耶穌就喺呢度又再更加詳細嚟解釋。啊 ，Now we look at verse twelve。我哋讀第十二節。Chapter thirteen, verse twelve。馬太福音十三章十二節。For whoever has to him more will be given, and he will have abundance. But whoever does not have, even what he has will be taken away from him. 第十二節，凡有的還要加給他，叫他有餘；凡沒有的，連他所有的也要奪去。啊、uh, ，there are two parts to this verse。咁呢誒嘅段呢節經文有兩部分。I guess the first part is quite easily understandable。咁第一段相信第一部分相信都好容易明白噶。啊、uh, ，because if you have then， 啊、uh, ，you know if you are willing to receive more then God will give you more。即係話意思話你願意領受多嘅話，神係願意俾你咁多。Uh, but what about the second part？ 咁嘅下一部分係點啊 ？It says but whoever does not have， 就係話嗰啲凡沒有嘅 ，even what he has will be taken away from him。連他所有嘅也要奪去。It's like you know it it doesn't sound logical。就係聽起上嚟唔唔合乎邏輯嘅。Uh, if I do not have， 如果我冇 ，then how can you take it from me？ 你點樣嚟將我 take anything away from me？ 你點樣嚟將我啲嘢嚟奪去咧？啊、uh, ，it it doesn't sound right， 呀、yeah? 啊。誒，聽起上嚟好似唔正確。Now what do you think Jesus is talking about here？ 如果你誒、呃、估下主耶穌其實喺呢度講乜嘢咧 ？Now when we talk about the word of God， 如果我哋講到神嘅話語 ，for example I received the word of God many years ago。例如嚟講，我領受神嘅話語好係係好多年之前啦。啊 ，and then I receive it with a heart of 啊、uh, ，you know。With a joyous heart。咁我以呢個喜樂嘅心嚟到去領受。And now, for whatever reason。咁而家唔知咩原因。Uh, I has decided, you know, to desert、uh, the word of God。而家我要要嚟到去分辨神嘅話語。Uh, so in the eyes of God, actually, I have nothing already。咁喺神嘅眼中，我係乜嘢都冇㗎。But not only that。唔單止係咁樣。When a person has departed from the word。如果一個人離開咗神嘅話語。What he has learned before。就係話佢之前所學到嘅 ，will also be taken away from him。亦都就從佢嘅身上被奪去。Meaning that this person will know nothing。就係話意思呢個人係冇嘢冇嘢知道嘅。啊 ，so we have to take the word of God very seriously。所以我哋要看神嘅話語好嚴肅咁嚟看待。啊 ，we must honour the word。
我哋你要尊重你神嘅话语。啊、uh, ，so in this way we shall receive more from the Lord。咁样样嘅话，我哋就从主耶稣嗰度得到更多。Uh, I guess we have also、uh, seen for ourselves in our life, even in the church community。相信呢一点喺我哋嘅人生或者系教会嘅团体里边，我哋都睇到。Uh, we we have witnessed for ourselves, you know, how the you know members were very strong before。咁我哋要都見證到有啲信徒之前咧係非常之堅固嘅。啊 ，even workers of God were very strong before。甚至乎神嘅工人係非常之堅強嘅。啊 ，they work mightily for God。佢好大大嚟到被神使用。啊 ，you know they went round preaching the gospel。佢周圍嚟到傳福音。啊 ，but now when you look at them， 而家你睇下佢哋。啊 ，some of them had have already disappeared。有啲已經係。唔存在啦。啊 ，because they no longer come to the church。因为佢哋已经唔再嚟教会啦。Or they no longer believe in in the word of the Lord。或者佢哋唔应唔应诶唔再相信神嘅话。Because God has taken everything away from them。因为神已经将佢所有嘅夺去。Now why does God do that？ 点解神会咁样做咧 ？Because they show no respect to the word of God。因为佢向神嘅话语冇显露呢个尊敬。That's why when we talk about rooting, allow the word of God to root in us。所以我哋讲到话，将神嘅话语嚟喺我哋心里边扎根。Our attitude must be transformed。我哋嘅态度一定要改变。Uh, sometimes we show that kind of couldn't care less attitude。因为有时候我哋个诶显露出一个唔在乎嘅嗰种嘅态度。Uh, whether we listen or we don't listen, it doesn't really matter。或者我哋听或者唔听都唔唔重要啦。And we know that this is not correct。我哋知道呢个态度系唔正确嘅。Uh, if we want the word of God to take root in us。如果我哋想神嘅话语喺我哋心里边扎根嘅话。Uh, so we must readjust our mindset。所以我哋要调教下我哋嘅心思。So that we learn to fear God by honouring His word。所以我哋要学习敬畏神，藉着尊重神嘅话语。啊 ，You know, just like those recorded in the book of Hebrews。就正如喺诶希伯来书嗰度所记载嘅。啊 ，We can turn to Hebrews chapter two。啊，希伯来书第二章。啊 ，Turn to the book of Hebrews chapter two。希伯来书第二章。Uh, we read、uh, verse one. 我哋到第一节。Therefore, we must give the more earnest heed to the things we have heard, lest we drift away. 希伯来书二章一节，所以我们当正越发正重看，所以我们当越发正重所听见的道理，恐怕我们随流失去。Uh, here it says, give the more earnest heed. 呢度話俾我哋聽，當越發正重所聽見。Uh, if you if you look at the 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 verse here, it's like a process. Yeah. 我哋睇下呢句嘅話語，即係好似一個過程嚟。I just want to illustrate this point a bit more. 我哋想講下呢呢點。Uh, for example, last year. 例如嚟講喺舊年。Uh, I attended seventy percent of all the services that the church has arranged. 咁我係誒參加咗誒教會所安排嘅七。七十百分之七十嘅聚會。啊 ，you know， and in this year， 咁喺今年噶。I'm very determined to attend hundred percent of all all the services that the church has arranged。咁我就決定嚟，決定下定決心嚟到百分之一百嚟到去誒遵守誒誒教會所安排嘅聚會。啊 ，when when when I compare this， you know， two years。如果我我將呢兩年嚟去比較。啊 ，then I can say that I have given。More earnest heat to the things concerning salvation。咁我哋可以话俾我诶自己听，我系系诶当越发正重诶我我所听见嘅道理噶。啊 ，Now if this year I spend less time in in prayer， 如果我今年诶花少啲时间喺祷告上 ，I spend more time in the things of the world。我反而嘅，我花咁多嘅時間喺世上嘅事情。啊、uh, ，actually I'm I'm drifting away from God。其實我係慢慢嚟到去離開神㗎。啊、uh, ，so if we do not take heed， 如果我哋唔小心嘅話，啊、uh, ，if we do not give a more earnest heed to what we have heard， 如果我哋唔當越發正重所聽見嘅道理 ，there is only one result， 只有一個嘅結果。啊、uh, ，what is that result？ 呢個結果係乜嘢嘢咧 ？We shall be drifting away。我哋就會離開神。啊、uh, ，therefore we must honour the word of God。所以我哋真係要尊敬神嘅话语。啊 ，we read the verse two。我哋到第二节。For if the word spoken through angels proved steadfast, and every transgressions and disobedience received a just reward。第二节，那藉天使所传的话。
既是確定，凡光化暴業的，都受了該受的暴刑。Uh, verse three. 三節。How shall we escape if we neglect so great a salvation, which as the first began to be spoken by the Lord and was confirmed to us by those who heard heard him? 第三節，我們若忽略這麼大的救恩，怎能逃罪呢？這救恩起先是主親自講的。后来是听见的人给我们证实了。Uh, now here it talks about messages of salvation。呢度就系话诶诶信息嘅使者。Messages of salvation。系救恩嘅使者。救恩嘅信息。救恩嘅信息。啊、uh, ，now so we must 啊、uh, honour and respect。所以我哋要尊重同埋佢誒尊敬嘅。啊、uh, ，when you read the chapter one。如果我讀讀第一節嘅話。啊、uh, ，we see that you know like the members did not even understand who Jesus was。甚至乎誒、uh, 第一章嘅裏邊有有啲信徒係唔明白神係邊一個。啊、uh, ，they did not know who Jesus really was。佢哋唔知道主耶穌就係邊一個。啊、uh, ，that's why the writer has to spend time to explain to them again。所以呢個作者就係話用啲時間嚟到去再寫信俾佢哋。啊 ，that's why you find that if you are not serious, then even the most basic knowledge shall be taken away from them。如果我哋唔認真嘅話，甚至乎我哋基本嘅道理嘅基知識都會嚟到去被奪去。啊 ，you know you find that these people will be drifting away。我哋知道呢啲人就會被奪去。啊 ，you know we always talk about 啊、uh, ，we need to honour the ten articles of faith。我哋時常都都要教被教導，我哋要尊敬我哋嘅十大信條。啊、uh, ，because you know when when we、uh, take seriously the ten articles of faith of the church。如果我哋認真嚴肅咁看待我哋教會嘅十大信條、啊、，we allow the word of God to take root in us。咁即係話我哋讓神嘅話語喺我哋心裏邊。And we know for sure that the foundations of our faith is sure。咁我哋好確定我哋嘅根基就話好好穩固啦。Uh, we shall not be shaken。咁我哋就唔會搖動啦。Uh, because we have a sure foundation。因為我哋有一個確定嘅根基。Uh, we turn back to Matthew chapter thirteen。我哋翻翻嚟马太福音第十三章。啊、uh, ，We turn back to Matthew chapter thirteen。马太福音第十三章。啊、uh, ，We can read now the in verse thirteen。我哋读第十三节。啊、uh, ，Therefore I speak to them in parables, because seeing they do not see, and hearing they do not hear, nor do they understand。第十三节，所以我用比喻对他们讲，是因他们看也看不见，听也听不见，也不明白。Now there is a question we need to ask。有一個問題我哋需要問嘅。Is Jesus talking about people who do not know him？ 係咪主耶穌 ？Only？ 只係同嗰啲誒唔認識佢嘅人講呢？啊、uh, ，You find that you know like what we said this is a parable concerning evangelism。我哋知道之前講過呢個比喻有關於宣道嘅事情。啊、uh, ，Which is very very true。呢個係真實㗎。嗱 ，But in fact it also talks about people who know God before。咁亦都講嗰啲嗰啲已經認識神嘅人嘅，認識耶穌嘅人。Uh, how do we know？ 我哋點知道咧 ？Again, when you look at verse fourteen。同樣嘅，我哋讀第十四節嘅時候。Uh, here it mentions about the prophecy of Isaiah。呢度就講以賽亞先知嘅預言。Uh, this is quoted in Isaiah chapter six。呢啲我哋係喺以賽亞書第六章所記載嘅。Uh, I guess if you have read the Acts of the Apostle before。咁我相信，如果你之前讀過《使徒行傳》嘅話。Uh, in fact, Paul also mentioned this。咁其實保羅已經提及到呢點。Uh, on his way, you know, when he、uh, he was ministering at Rome， 當佢喺羅馬嚟到去傳福音嘅時候、uh, ，and he mentioned this， 佢亦都提及到。Uh, we can turn to chapter twenty-eight, Acts of the Apostle。請打開使徒行傳二十八章。Uh, Acts of the Apostle, chapter twenty-eight。使徒行傳二十八章。Now we we find that in verse twenty-six。我哋睇喺二十六節嗰度。And twenty-seven。同埋二十七節。嗱、uh, ，this， 誒、uh, ，these two verses are actually quotation from Isaiah chapter six as well。咁呢兩節嘅經文亦都係從以賽亞書第六章嗰度所記載嘅。啊、uh, ，Who do you think Paul was talking？ 誒、uh, ，talking to？ 咁你認為保羅係其實對緊邊啲人講話咧 ？Now I want you to read the verse nineteen。我哋讀下第十九節。Uh, Acts chapter twenty-eight verse nineteen。使徒行傳二十八章十九節。But when the Jews spoke against it, I was compelled to appeal to Caesar, not that I had anything of which、uh, to accuse my nation。第十九節，無奈猶太人不服我，不服我不得已，只好上告於該撒。
并非有什么事要控告我本国的百姓。Uh, the point I'm making is that he was talking to the Jews at the time. 其实我要讲嘅当时系佢哋诶保罗对嗰啲犹太人所讲嘅。Uh, not only that, in verse twenty-five. 唔单止系咁，喺二十五节嗰度。It becomes even clearer. 咁你又就好更加清楚啦。Uh, we read the verse twenty-five. 我哋读第二十五节。And so when they did not agree among themselves, they departed. After Paul has said one word, the Holy Spirit spoke rightly through. Isaiah, the prophet to our fathers. 第二十五节，他们彼此不合，就散了。未散已先，保罗说了一句话，说：圣灵即先知以赛亚向你们祖宗所说的话是不错的。啊、uh, ，so you find that these two verses are also given to those who know God. 咁咧，我哋知道呢两节圣经亦都系俾嗰啲已经认识神嘅人。But Are given to those who are rebellious. 亦都要俾嗰啲誒悖逆嘅人。啊 ，they they knew God. 佢哋係認識神。啊 ，but they were not willing to submit to God. 但係佢哋唔願意信服神。And therefore, these two verses were given to warn them. 所以呢兩節聖經嚟到去警告佢哋。啊 ，now we turn back to I、uh, Matthew chapter thirteen. 我哋翻翻嚟馬太福音第十三章。啊 ，we turn back to Matthew chapter thirteen. 馬太福音第十三章。Now I just want you to look at、uh, verse fifteen. Yes.、Yeah? 我哋睇下第十五节。Why is it that they cannot understand? 点解佢哋系唔明白咧 ？Verse fifteen it says, "For the hearts of these people have grown dull; their ears are hard of hearing, and their eyes they have closed, lest they should see with their eyes and hear with their ears, lest they should understand with their hearts and turn, so that I should heal them." 第十五节，因为这百姓又蒙了心，耳朵发沉，眼睛闭着，恐怕眼睛看见，耳朵听见，心里明白，回转过来，我就医治他们。啊、uh, ，here it says their hearts, you know, are not right before God。呢度话俾我哋听，佢哋嘅心喺神嘅眼前系神神嘅面前系唔正确。And therefore they could not hear。所以佢唔能够听。Nor could they see。亦都唔能够睇得见。Uh, let's look at some、uh, passages given by Paul。我哋睇下誒保羅所俾我哋嘅一啲嘅方法。啊、uh, uh, ，We turn to Ephesians。睇下以弗所書。啊 ，We turn to Ephesians chapter four。以弗所書第四章。啊 ，We read from verse seventeen。我哋讀第十七節開始。啊 ，Ephesians chapter four。We read verse seventeen。以弗所書四章十七節。啊、uh, ，This I say therefore and testify in the Lord that you should no longer walk as the rest of the Gentiles walk. In the futility of their mind. 十七节，所以我说，且在主里确实的说，你们行事不要再像外邦人全虚妄的身行事。And、now, having their understanding darkened, being alienated from the life of God, because of the ignorance that is in them, because of the blindness of their heart. 第十八節，他們心底昏昧，與神所賜的生命隔絕了，都因自己無知，心裏剛硬。啊，有 a number of phrases that we need to look at more closely。有幾個嘅句子，我哋要細心仔細嚟睇㗎。And first is the futility of their mind。首先就係睇佢哋全虛妄嘅心。啊 ，the second is their understanding darkened。就係話佢哋嘅心底嚟到去分昧啦。啊 ，and verse eighteen, the last part says the blindness of their hearts。但係第第十八節最後嗰句，佢嘅心裏嘅光啊。啊 ，how is it that you know they become a blind or they become darkened in their hearts？ 佢哋點解嚟到去心底昏昏暗嚟到去瞎眼啊 ？It has a lot to do with their way, their ways of life。就係話同佢哋嘅生活誒好大嘅關係㗎。啊 ，so you know in the past before they came to know Jesus， 睇翻喺過去佢哋未認識主耶穌之前。啊 ，you find that you know they they were Gentiles walking in sin。就係話佢哋係外邦人，係行全行喺罪惡當中。Now today you can imagine。今日你可以想象一下。啊 ，if we walk in sin, walk in darkness。如果我哋仍然喺罪裏邊，喺黑暗裏邊。Then surely we cannot understand the word。好肯定嘅，我哋唔能夠明白神嘅話語。And you find that you know listening to the word of God is a burden。我哋發覺聽神嘅話語就好似重擔咁樣。It's too hard to to hear。你話好難聽嘅。啊 ，it's so hard for our eyes to open to understand what the word of God is all about。好難嚟到睜開我哋嘅眼睛睇下神嘅話語究竟係點樣樣啊！啊 ，now that's why you know Paul also warns warns Timothy. 
咁保罗也都警告呢个提摩太 We turn to 2 Timothy 看看提摩太后书, chapter 4第四章 2 Timothy chapter 4提摩太后书第四章 We read verse 3 and verse 4 3, 4节 For the time will come when they will not endure sound doctrine but according to their own desire because they have itching ears they will heap up for themselves teachers. 第三節,因為時候要到,人必厭煩從這的道理,以多發揚,就隨從自己的情慾,真天好些師父. Uh, here is saying itching ears that cannot hear the pure words of God. Uh, why is it so? Uh, because they rely not on the Holy Spirit, but rather on uh, the, their so-called teachers. That's why he said they heaped up for themselves teachers. They can never be taught by the Holy Spirit himself. That's why they could not hear the word. Alright, so you know, in order to uh, to listen, uh, we must uh, you know free ourselves. From any form of corruption. Uh, there's one more point I want to bring to your attention here. It seems that it is not fair if because God actually is the one who darkens their heart. Uh, it's like God, you know, caused them not to see. Uh, and not to hear as well. Uh, how do we explain this? Uh, now, obviously, we need to go back uh, to the book of Isaiah to understand, uh, you know, uh, the, the actual uh, context. Uh, we turn to Isaiah chapter 6. Uh, Isaiah chapter 6. Now, you know, when Isaiah was uh, willing the, to be sent, and God uh, said to him that, you know, he would send him uh, to a people who do not hear. Uh, no matter how you try, they will not listen. Now, I want you to read verse 11. Yeah. Chapter 6, verse 11. Then I said, Lord, how long? Uh, and the reply is, until the cities are laid waste and without inhabitant, the houses are without a man, the land is utterly desolate. Uh, quite clearly, these people would not listen at all. But again, we still need to answer the first question that I asked. It's like God is the one who, who caused them not to see, not to hear, uh, and not to understand. Uh, now, we know that God is a just God. Uh, God will not force anyone to listen to his word. I just want to give you a very simple example. We always said God helps those who help themselves. The same principle applies here. God hardens those who harden themselves. Uh, since they have chosen to harden their own heart, so God will give up on them, and their hearts will become hardened. And so the choice is ours. In listening to the word of God, uh, so we can either reject or we received. 
我哋一系嚟抗拒，一系领受。啊、uh, ，we can reject the word of God with our stubborn heart。我哋可以用一个横眼嘅心嚟到去拒绝神嘅话。Or we can receive the word of God with a heart of repentance。或者我哋用一个啊悔改谦卑嘅心嚟到去领受神嘅话。啊、uh, ，so if we do uh the uh the latter， 如果我哋读诶、uh, 选择后半段嘅话，啊、uh, ，then we find that we shall be blessed。咁我哋又发觉我哋就会被蒙福。啊、uh, ，in this way you see that the word of God will gradually。Take root in us. 咁我哋就发觉，如果咁做嘅话，神嘅话语慢慢喺我哋心里边扎根啦。啊 ，so today we can see. 今日我哋睇得见。啊 ，we can also hear. 你哋听得见。啊 ，because we are willing to draw close to God. 因为我哋愿意嚟到去亲近神。啊 ，just like the convocation here, and so many of you are willing to come here in person to worship God. 正如今日嘅灵恩会，我哋在座咁多位诶信徒诶慕道者都愿意嚟到去亲近神。Uh, I believe that with a correct mindset， 我相信如果大家有一个正确嘅心态 ，then you find that you know it's like we prepare our hearts to receive the word of God。咁我哋就系咁样嚟预备我哋心嚟到去领受神嘅话。Uh, thank God my sermon,、uh, the first sermon ends here。感谢神，我第一个正道到呢度。We sing a hymn。我哋唱赞美诗。啊 ，twenty four。二十四首。三月暴风，曾面耶稣基督，尊重神的意思，将两世三国最无，三名字。Thank、you.